I just watched an anime. Episode 3 of Oda Cinnamon no Banaga. This episode is called, quote, Canine Lords and Battle of OK Hazama Return? Question mark, unquote. So, you know, probably more boring history jokes. Every episode, Oda introduces himself. So I guess this shows, like, you could just watch whatever episode and just enjoy it for what it is. Yeah, I guess there isn't really a, a overarching plot other than the stuff with Blue. Anyway, the uh, Oda's owner takes him for a walk, and they go buy clothes on sale. And then someone said the word splurge, and it, I just remembered how uncomfortable that word makes me. Splurge. Uh, most of this show is really boring, particularly this episode. The jokes aren't that funny. Uh, they almost are sometimes, but that's usually only because the delivery of Oda's voice actor is very good. They almost had a good joke about the AC, but like air conditioning. But the narrator talking about talking about it, and some narrator started talking about some history bullshit before I could laugh, and it just ruined it. What can I? What did I expect? Anyway, all right, the first enjoyable thing that happens in this episode was a joke about bikinis it wasn't very lewd it was just funny unfortunately this is the first funny thing that happened in 10 minutes so you know and then they almost go for a walk but then they immediately get outside and it's way too hot so they just walk right back in that one was funny too skip ahead one of the dog warlords is married to another dog but that dog is a lady dog from re like renaissance french era where that ate that one lady who said let them eat cake yeah he's married to that be that be uh, there was a funny little it was a little funny when she was like talking about like i'm it's 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 all fake i'm actually a benevolent woman i'm a, I'm a philanthropist it's all fake news you know stuff as you know okay skip ahead so you know that guy blue he looks like a guy from Oda's past life, but he isn't. Funny enough, his pet squirrel is actually the guy reincarnated. So, you know, the more you know. There was also a random fourth wall break, which was really weird. This episode was really boring. I have very little notes on this one. The jokes that did hit were pretty funny, though. If this joke, if this this episode only had a few good jokes, if it didn't have any, I'd have to give it a one out of five because it would be a total waste of time. Total time killer. But there was a few good ones, so that will elevate this, keeping it in a two, 2 out of 5. I have a sinking feeling, though, that out of the 12 episodes that we're going to have to watch of this show, there's going to be at least one 1 out of 5. Anyway, that's it. Uh, see you next time. Don't watch this show. Bye.